Hey everybody, this is Dr. Flight. I hope you're doing great today. Uh, this is the beginning of week two for uh, Principles of Marketing, CBAD 350. And so just wanted to sh send a real quick um, informational video message, I suppose, to you folks out there in our online section of this course. Um, you have successfully navigated week number one. Um, and so let's get into week number two. I'm excited to, to, to see what we can do here. Week number two, we actually go into chapter four, which deals with organizational purpose and mission. And what we also do this week is talk a lot about um, cause-related marketing. So this is a strategy that firms use today when they're beginning to build a brand, um, beginning to build a personality or an image that they want the brand to have. Um, they'll sometimes associate themselves with a social ethos or cause or something like that. And so in a broad sense, this is called cause-related marketing. And it can be considered as a portion of or an extension of uh, corporate social responsibility efforts that the organization makes. It's a little bit different. It's not really CSR, um, but uh, it's, it's really a strategy uh, that organizations uh, use. So anyways, um, this, this also kind of calls into play how you can use marketing. There are a lot of organizations, just about any organization um, uses marketing, whether it's a government agency, a nonprofit, um, an individual person, um, there's personal marketing, or as you may, of course, realize, um, for, for profit organizations as well. So the use and the techniques that are kind of about when it comes to marketing are, are actually used in lots of different organizational forms. And so this week we step back and we talk about the purpose of the organization a little bit more, the mission of the organization, and we really focus on this idea that organizations can um, fulfill a social purpose as well as a financial purpose and uh, marketing has a, a role to play in all of that. So, so chapter four, we also have some supplemental reading and so, or some other videos and, and reading that's available to you. Um, so watch the videos. There's some content that's, that's in the videos that's not in the text. So I, you need to watch the videos and kind of think about those materials to this week um, as well. Um, and, you know, as you continue to navigate Moodle, remember each of these tabs has a, is, is by week, plus we have some, some earlier tabs here, but this is CSR, Conscious and Cause-Related Marketing. That's the tab we're in this week for week number two. As you'll recall, week number one was an introduction to marketing. Had some videos that dealt with and just kind of talked about how marketing happens, um, kind of its role, its purpose, different eras of marketing, uh, those types of things, exchanges, there's some really, really kind of a broad base, I guess, uh, chapter one offers definition of marketing. Something I want to highlight in each of these areas, there's a word document here that's called a, it's basically a, a itemized list I'll just kind of pull this up here. I didn't do it earlier, but I will right now just so that just so that you have it um, in front of your screen. But but if you click on those, it's just a Word document that outlines the topics of the um, of the chapter. So on your tests, you're going to have some short answer questions, and those short answer questions come directly from these documents, these reviews. Okay, so use these reviews to study. If you know how to answer these questions, then uh, you'll be prepared for, for the tests that, that, are, that are coming up. Okay, so, so good job there. Just kind of a reminder that that's there for you as you navigate things. The other, other things, um, you, you've, you've done your first week's chapter summary. So that was chapter number one. Now we're going to do chapter number four. One thing that I want to also just kind of emphasize as something new is I, I want you to cite your 
source for your for your external um, resource that you use. We haven't really done that up to now, just week one, and I forgot to kind of include it in the in the kind of list of things. But just use whatever type of citation method you'd like. It doesn't matter to me how it's cited, just as long as at, you know at the end at the bottom you put your citation so I can go to your your um, article and I can read it myself. That's my goal. Um, so uh, please do that as we as we move as we move forward. Um, so otherwise, uh, the third thing I guess I'm going to mention while we're just sitting here, um, two more things actually. Don't forget that we have McGraw Hill Connect assignments. Um, there are going to be two assignments that will be due on or before the day of the first test. Okay, so there are two application assignments that are due on or before the first test that we have, which I believe is January 29th. That's the first test day. Um, the other thing that I'm going to show you real quick here <clears throat> is during each, three, each of our three weeks, each of our modules for each test, there's going to be a set of um, marketing metrics or measures that we use in marketing a lot. Um, and terms relating to um, the math behind marketing that you really need to know um, if you're going to be a business person or you're going to work in an organization and you're going to do anything, especially relating to marketing. So this is the first one. You're going to see a worksheet. The worksheet's something that you, you do, you download it, you, you fill out the answers, and then you upload it as your submission, and it'll be graded. And then the guide gives you a how to do each of the each of the different types of problems. Okay, so read the guide, work the guide, do them in parallel, do the worksheet, read the guide simultaneously, and you'll have no problem doing those. Um, that's the goal. That's the goal with that. Okay, so um, yep, this is just a roundup here. The last thing I think I'm going to offer or show you. This is again downloaded. This is our schedule. Um, so our course schedule for the term, um, and um, these are the things that we're doing, okay? So you can kind of see week one we just finished, and uh, week two you see the topics that we're covering, the text materials, you have PowerPoints, you have, in, in fact, you have... Um, you don't have in-class lectures. I, I really I should have pulled up the online version of this, but it's all the same. So you have you have these things do. We have the chapter four, the content summary, just like you did last week for chapter one. You have the content summary due Sunday at midnight, and then and then in this column here, it's kind of hard to see, but this column here we have our homework assignments. So you actually have two homework assignments. Connect application assignments. Those are, again are going to be due by five o'clock on Monday the 29th, and that's when um, our test is. Uh, our test opens on Monday. You have the day to do the test, and then it closes at five. So you need to be done by five o'clock on Monday on the test. The other homework assignment would be that metrics worksheet that I just talked about. Okay, so these these things, these homework assignments, are all due on the test day. The summaries, chapter summaries, are all due Sunday at midnight. Okay, we're getting into a routine now. After this week, we're going to be kind of well into the routine. It'll be kind of a, a standard thing that we're doing. Um, but I want to just give you some backfill, back kind of just background, I guess, on this this roundup. Make sure we're all on the same page. Let me know if you have any questions. It's great having you in class. I love to hear from you. So um, again, take care. Have a great week.